Hey, what is going on guys? My name's Long Sensation and today we've got for you guys is some more Call of Duty Advanced Warfare information. Now this information is actually going to be regarding the Pro Editions for Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. In previous years these was also known as the Collector's Edition and the Prestige Edition, but this year they've changed it up a little bit. They've decided to call them the Atlas Limited Edition and the Atlas Pro Edition. So I'm going to go through which each ones will get you guys. And there's some really, really interesting things uh, within this kind of, you know, pre-order bonus, so to speak. So let's just get straight into it. First of all, if you pre-order the game itself, just the game, you'll receive the BAL-27 Assault Rifle, which I believe is the uh, weapon that can kind of print off bullets. And you'll also receive an advanced Arsenal player patch. Uh, with a few other additional bonuses but if you decide to upgrade to the uh, atlas limited edition which will cost you 80 dollars then you'll get a hell of a lot more for your money and i'm just going to briefly explain uh, what you'll be able to get so first of all you'll be able to get a brand new multiplayer bonus map which of course will go into the game as a kind of normal map anyway after a couple of months that's what they did with nuketown 2025 and also with uh, Free Fall for Call of Duty Ghost, but you'll be able to get Atlas Gorge, which is a bonus multiplayer map, and what makes this map really, really cool is it is actually a remake uh, from Call of Duty 4, the Modern Warfare map pipeline, so that is going to be really cool to see, it's going to be interesting to see how they've reskinned it and remastered it, but that is a part of the Atlas Limited Edition. And moving on, you'll also be able to get two brand new weapons, one of those weapons being the BAL-27 Assault Rifle, and a new weapon which will be an Atlas-themed pistol. Now, I'm not sure if this is going to be laser weaponry, I'm not sure if these weapons are going to be overpowered. I would imagine they're just going to be kind of standard weapons, but it would be cool to be able to run around with those weapons, because of course you'll be one of the only people uh, that actually has them, because not everyone has got money. For the limited editions but moving on you'll also be able to get an atlas exoskeleton which actually tells me that instead of being able to just buy micro dlcs for advanced warfare for your camos for your guns you'll also be able to do the same for exoskeletons this year so that's going to be really cool something we've never seen before really really unique and uh, moving on you'll also be able to get an atlas player card not really that exciting but this is where it gets really exciting. You'll also be able to receive five bonus supply drops. Now, I'm not sure what this means. As soon as I read this, I thought that it was going to be something based on Counter-Strike. If you're familiar with their system, how they kind of do supply drops. They drop off crates where you can unlock them buying keys. And when you actually buy these keys, uh, you can actually get a weapon uh, which will have a different camo and stuff like that. It's a really, really fun way. It's a really kind of unique way. And I've always thought to myself that they should incorporate that uh, within a Call of Duty sometime. I believe I did a video for Call of Duty Ghosts. Uh, maybe, who knows, maybe they actually saw that video and decided to incorporate it within Advanced Warfare. I really, really doubt it, but put in the comment section below what you think this five, uh, these supply drops will be, because you will be receiving five bonus supply drops uh, for Advanced Warfare if you decide to buy the Atlas Limited Edition. As well as this, you'll also be able to get a single player XO uh, skeleton upgrade token, which will allow you to upgrade your exoskeleton within single player. Uh, if you do not know, if you progress through single player, you'll receive tokens which you can then add, you know, extra boost, extra strength, etc. to your exoskeleton and you'll also just be able to get uh, an extra one if you decide to pre-order uh, with this bonus edition. But as well as this, you'll also get a booklet which is kind of standard. You get one of those with every Call of Duty. It tells you about the game and stuff like that. Uh, really, really cool. But moving on, if you decide to get the next upgrade, which will be the Atlas Pro Edition, which will cost you $120. It includes everything within the package I just talked about, the Atlas Limited Edition, but you'll also receive uh, the Advanced Warfare Season Pass, which includes all of the D DLCs throughout the year, which of course is pretty standard if you want to buy the Season Pass. But me personally, I think I'm just going to go for the kind of standard edition 
and then by the season pass, uh, you know, later on, uh, maybe sometime after Christmas when the DLC uh, number one actually comes out. But put in the comment section below, guys, what you think this bonus supply drops means. Really interested. And also put in the comment section below if you think you're going to be buying one of these limited editions. Uh, but anyway, guys, that is pretty much it from me. If you did enjoy, please be sure to show your support. Anyway, guys, I've been Long Sensation. Thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next video.